Good morning, this is Bruce and welcome back to my shop after a long stay away. <coughs> uh, that's another story and another movie. <coughs> what we have here is a double race bearing uh, that um, is going to replace a single uh, taper roller bearing. Now the single taper roller bearing um, is, a, uh, is, a, is, a, is an inch bearing and this, the closest we could get to be able to have this single, uh, this double, um, uh, this double bearing, it was in in a metric size. So I have to reduce the outside diameter of this bearing uh, to the same size as the cup. And um, I'm just going to demonstrate now using the ceramic um, ceramic cutter. And this is a. And you can see it there, it's a WNGA 080408A669N ceramic cutter. Um, and uh, I'm only going to do a short one here because um, time is an essence, but we'll, um, we'll show more later. Um, we've now reduced this down to 2.891 and we need to get, we need to get down to 2.874. Um, so we've got uh, 16 thou to go, um, but we've, uh, we're doing this in steps um, because you can't hold this bearing any other way. So I'm going to be machining the one half and then resetting it up and machining the other half. But it's more to demonstrate how the ceramic manages to work with this um, with hardened steel. So we're going to head out here into the thing and we're going to kick starter and show you some nice machining here. Now you can work with hardened steel with the ceramic. To be extremely careful with the ceramic of course because it's very brittle. Um, and I'm feeling my way through using the compound in this case. And I'm heading towards the uh, heading towards the chuck. And I'll also cut back with it as well because uh, there will be a little bit of load on this. And after that I'll set the, G the DRO again. And back to where I, the first cut that I did. Uh, with an ordinary tip, we'll now cut that through so we get close to the jaws. And you can see there that it's had a very, very nice cut, it's almost Nothing would be a micron. Left here, coming off. And at the same time, we can say that we're holding the camera here uh, with the Noga Hold It arm, which was um, donated to me by uh, Abby Widowski when I visited the Noga um, workshop uh, factory in northern Israel a couple of weeks ago um, and that's also a subject of another movie. So there we go we've done our, our second cut basically we'll take some measurements and we'll carry on from there. <coughs> 